This video is how to identify five areas where water can leak, possible leaks. 90% of any flat roof leak is from flashing. And let me start showing you all five areas. The one is they've stuck out this wall and they stuck out over tar. Look here. There's the old tar. So they smear tar on this wall before they did it and they came and they stuck out again over the tar. And look, water can just go behind there. You see that? That's one leak. So you have to identify your leaks. So that, if this stucco cracks again, it gets behind there. And this was wet when I took this off this morning. You can see they put tar, look, look at the caulking. Okay, that's one. All right. Another possible leak. This has a rubber boot around this. And you can see the rubber boot, look, it's, it's starting to crack open there. But water can just seep in between this pipe and this rubber right down there. So you need to seal this. All right, let me show you another leak. This is one of the big ones. <clears throat> this is one of the big, big leaks on commercial roofs. And I want to show you, people don't recognize it. Do you see, you see this rub, this foam? This is just foam. And water, the people tar around that foam and the foam breaks out. But you can see water can get in there, right there between the pipe. The foam, the foam broke away and the water can get in between this pipe and that foam. Even here, look here, huge. People just put tar, they don't know what they're doing. You cannot. Look here. Look at this. See that? That's water just gets in there. This is one of the big ones on a commercial roof. Okay? Let's go to another place. <clears throat> Where did we see this one? There, right? Just just take a video. See there? Between a pipe. See there? It always leaks there. This is one of the big ones. Alright, so the the number four. Leak number four, fourth area where it can leak. You can see paint. They painted the wall, which is okay to seal it. But they went with caulking over the paint. And I want to show you, look here. See, you, it's you can barely see it. Most of the times it's hard to detect, but look, slight crack there, slight crack. And you'll see that slight crack. Just do this and you'll see. It's peeling from the from the wall, the caulking. It will peel. That slight crack I, diverts the water. The water comes down here, goes right into that crack, and causes the leak. So you got to really be watching this. So right behind that caulking, that slight crack there, uh, there's several areas where it cracked like that. But they painted right over, and the caulking went over the... Let me see, look, just peeling this off. There's nothing. You cannot do that, and it's never last. Now, it's good to paint the wall, but you cannot have... <clears throat> let, me, let me explain something. <clears throat> this is flashing. 90% of the leaks are from flashing. The roof comes up underneath this flashing. The flashing is supposed to get the water over the roof. That's why it's underneath. So that's how the flashing works. The termination flashing, is, uh, they, what they did was they nailed it with a fasteners against the wall. And then they caulked this little area here. That is most of the times that will fail because the caulking is only a very small section of, it doesn't adhere to the wall. Let me show you. Let me show you. See how the, the flashing comes loose from the wall? It sticks to the metal. It sticks to the metal, but it never sticks to the wall. Caulking. Look, this is all wet. And you see the dirt? The dirt accumulated behind the caulking. And it just keeps going. That is one of the big big, big, big leaks on a roof, okay? So the other, the last section I've identified 
is these stove pipes. Any of these pipes sticks out. So this, the owner in this case tried to make a repair and he put something around here. That's the leak right there. It's cracked right underneath this and this is falling apart. So I've identified five areas where water can leak and I'm gonna show you how to make these repairs every one by itself. So let's go to the next, watch the next section how to do these repairs. <laughs>